Last year, 17-year-old Michael White was hit by a car. After more than a dozen surgeries, doctors thought they would have to amputate one of his legs. Well, Micah has written about his incredible experience. He will debut his book today at Destiny Youth Center in Milwaukee. Michael White is joining us in our studio this morning. Good morning to you. Good morning. All right, so this is your book. It's called Dear God, yeah. and we'll talk about it in just a moment. But first, let's rewind to March 2013. What happened? Well, um, I was walking between the two cars. Um, I was going to the back driver's seat, and as I was going over there, the uh, car behind me was parking. And uh, when it was parking, it slid over a sheet of ice, which crushed me in between the two cars. And so you were immediately taken to the hospital. Right. You spent the better part of two months in the hospital, yeah, right? Yeah, yeah. And what do you attribute your healing to? I attribute all of it to God. All of the credit goes to God, man. It's impossible that it could have been any other way, you know? And this book that you've written, Dear God, is a series of letters that you wrote yeah. to God during this process? Yeah, well, actually, I did write them uh, while I was in the hospital, but I took myself back to those nights when I was in the hospital, when I, uh, the nights that I just had to cry, the nights that, you know, I just smiled just to keep from showing my pain. And I went back and I wrote all of these letters. I said, what would I say to God if I could say anything? And, and so tell me what it was like in the hospital. When did you start to realize that you would be able to actually keep your leg? I realized it when I just, you know, said, I'm not going to worry about it anymore. I'm not, this isn't something that I have to worry about. If I lose my leg, you know what, I still have my other leg. I'm just going to keep going, you know. It's not going to stop me here. And I see you now, it's, it's your right leg, correct? And, yes. and you have a brace on it. So uh, what is the prognosis? What's the future? Well, um, the doctors that, well, actually the bone that I had wasn't supposed to grow at all, you know, so, but I, last time I went to the doctor, the bone is almost completely healed. So what they're saying now is that, you know, the brace is temporary for right now, and I can switch off anytime I want. So. We have a few, just a few seconds left, Micah. What would your encouragement be to so many out there who are facing what may seem like an impossible challenge, that may seem, be facing difficult odds? Don't give up. It don't give up. It's so easy to give up, but it's harder to keep pushing on. And you know, and when you push on, you get there. You get there. Just don't worry about it. You know. All right. Well, you can meet Micah tonight at Destiny Youth Center. What time? At 8 p.m. All right. And then you'll have copies of your book available. We'll have copies. Yes. And, and we'll sign have, them. Yes. Yes. And we'll have a concert for everyone. So please come out. All right. Sounds like a terrific event. Michael White, thank you so much for coming in thank you for and having sharing me. your story with us. For more on Micah and his book, you can head to our website, tmj4.com, and click on links.